shovel, man. Hey, I'm trying, man. Christ. It's fucking hard, man. Can't you see this? I'm not fucking 12 feet tall. We could have been down by now if you used your fucking back, man. I'm trying, man. Put your legs into us. I'm trying. Get off my fucking back, man. I'm digging with midgets all the time. Man, fuck you, man. At least I'm not 12 feet tall. Oh, my 12 feet tall to help me get this fucking hole. Oh, you see my dude in my damn shit. seem like nice guys. You know, I think I'd like to be friends. So, I won't shoot you. I won't even have you take off your masks. Which, <laughs> with my resources, doesn't make much of a difference. Do you want us to blow each other or something? I can see how you would go that way. But no, I'm just a really rich guy looking for a couple of friends. And you two are presumably lacking in funds. And are in dire need of a friend right now. That's where our relationship begins. <laughs> wait, wait, do you want to blow one of us or something? No. What I'm cooking up is more of a working relationship. In addition to not turning you in or turning you out, I'll pay you both quite handsomely. By my standards, of course. And all you need to do is every 30 days, pick up the phone and do me the occasional favor. What, what kind of favors? Oh, don't worry. I won't have you hurt anybody or kill anyone. My needs are much more. So. Prison? Or a couple of favors. What will it be? Can we think about it? We'll give you five minutes. <laughs> oh, man, this is fucking bullshit, man. You say that every time. <sighs> well, what else should I say? I don't know. There's always silence, Tommy. Damn. But yeah, sure, but doesn't this give you the willies? I mean, I figure I'd be used to it by now, man, but this is fucking spooky. It's none of my business. You know, I'm just happy we're not in jail. Have you ever thought to ask yourself why? I mean, I'd be happy to speculate, but I mean, I'm just saying, I figured you'd be at least a bit curious. Uh, oh, not really. Oh, it's pretty fucked, man. Yep. And you don't even want to think about what he could be doing with those dead bodies. As far as I can tell, one of two things. Neither of which makes for a pleasant music. Two? Well, he's either fucking them or eating them. Or both. Holy shit. Cannibalism never even occurred to me. <clears throat> Honestly, it's probably the more likely. <clears throat> you would be surprised about how many cannibals there actually are out there. And rich folks have all sorts of notions about drinking the blood of humans and vitality and all of that. Plus, this guy has money. He could probably fuck anyone he wants. 
Yeah. Best not to think about it too much though. I mean, these women are dead. Dude. What? I'm just saying. I mean, I don't condone this shit, but if it's gonna happen, I'd rather it be my ticket out of jail card, you know? Yeah, sure. Flip for? <laughs> Fuck you, Tommy. I mean, I hear you, but it's like, how long is this reasonable? I mean, you know, uh, it's been months. Pick the fucking bag up, Tommy. I'm just saying, you know, it isn't like we ever signed a contract. I just don't want this asshole thinking he can rope us into this forever just because he's got us by the balls, you know what I mean? I mean, it just seems to be like, you know, it seems to be like how long is long enough to ask for terms, you know? All right, all right, turn this today. Let's just continue letting them fuck these dead bodies. You wanna get the fucking door? Shit, I gotta do everything. No, man, stay, stay there, stay you, there, man. stay there. You didn't there. tell me shit. As always, I'm always doing everything. Oh, fuck you, man. Make sure you hold it tight this time. I'm gonna hold drop it, tight. it like you did last time. I will time. hold it tight. Get off my ass. You ready? Yeah. You ready? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. God damn it, let's One, go. One, two, two, three. I got this. All right, all right. Good job, good job. Now, all right, hear me out. Hear me out. I really don't think he's fucking these corpses, man. You serious? I mean, it's a corpse. Come on. I, I don't know, okay. man. But hear me out. Hear me out. I say we wait for any confrontation to pop off, and then we use our silence to our advantage because I really think it can help us in this situation. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. I don't know. I mean, you look it's like a dead body, man. Okay. Fucking wrap a corpse, man. Hey. Let's make a bet. I don't gamble anymore, Tommy. 12-step program. Hey, hey, hey. Come on, dude. Hey, is it really gambling if there's no money involved? I'm listening. Okay. Look, it's simple, man. Let's just... Stick around for a while, see what goes down. If he commits necrophilia, wherever the fuck it is, man, then we confront the fucker, because, hey, let's admit it, it's much worse. And if not, then we just table it for a wait, while. Wait, wait, wait. Why? Wait, wait bruh. How the, how the fuck is necrophilia worse? I mean... Are you joking right now? Oh, fuck out of here. How is necrophilia worse? You gotta be shitting me, dude. It, it's probably pretty subjective. It's not better, but that, still. No, it's not. Okay, agree to disagree, man. Agree to disagree. What the fuck does that word mean, subjective, by the way? <sighs> fucking idiot, dude. I'm just asking, man. You know how I feel about the big words, I told you. She's pretty sexy, though, right? Dude, you're fucking sick. Hey, I'm not the one who thinks cannibalism is worse than necrophilia. Like I said, I don't intend on biting the hand that feeds me. Wait, now how much is he paying you? That isn't important. Look. I'm just saying, it's really hard to compare this to all the other shit that I would be doing. Hey, it's pretty easy, actually. I mean, first of all, robbing rich douchebags is definitely better for the world than procuring dead bodies for this rich creep to eat and or fuck. You know, I never took you to be a consequentialist. Hey, you know how I feel about that word, man. Consequential, little word. Fuck yeah, that that's, that's the word. Well? Okay, fine. But if he catches us, you have to take all the blame. I can deal with that. Yeah, that's what you do.
I'm not conceiving. I'm not conceiving. Don't you but see the film there? Yo, yo. I'm just saying. The longer we stay here, the more likely he is to catch us, okay? Yeah, so that's a risk I'm willing to take. This is a song. Forgive me if I get a little emotional. You get more comfortable. I'll snack the food. What? Not hungry? You always get so nervous during celebrations. Well, that's okay, baby. I can eat and drink enough for the both of us. Shooting anything? I mean, man, man, we can't back out now. Not until we know. This is your conscience, not mine. A little bit late for that, don't you think? You look gorgeous. I always love when you wore that dress. It really brings out your eyes. So, I know things have been tumultuous lately. But we'll get back to where we were. We always do. Poor thing, you look exhausted. You know, you won't offend me if you just want to go upstairs and go to bed. I mean, we have, we have plenty of anniversaries left. Okay, okay, what if I change my fucking mind?
I told me it's a top. If you would like to change my fucking rules, it's a fucking top. to you on a night like this. <sighs> Very much like this, actually. <sighs> and every time the sky resembles that day, <sighs> it just brings me back. In my heart. Listen, I know we fought, we fought a lot last time when we talked about it, but I think I've come around to the idea of having kids. If that's what it takes to make you stay, I'll do it. I can't lose you. I won't lose you. Do you have a death wish or something? I think he lost his wife, man. Well, so what? People die all the time. Man. Clearly, he isn't taking this well. Well, no shit, man. Have a fucking heart, man. He's heartbroken. Dude, I know that doesn't make any of this better, but come on, let's at least cut him some slack. Slack? What the fuck kind of slack? He's rich, and he fucks corpses that look like his late wife, and he's blackmailing us. Yes, yeah, I, I know. I just feel bad for the guy. Okay? Well, feel bad for us, man. We're the ones risking jail time so that this asshole can get his jollies off. I say we quit. You can quit. I need the money. So it's like that? Yeah, it's like that. I'm about my money, man and judgments are for people with money. Just take me home. I appreciate the discretion as always, Tony. Yeah. By the way, Tommy's out. No matter. He won't be... He won't be telling anyone about our arrangement, will he? Nah. I don't think you have anything to worry about. Excellent. I'll be in touch. <laughs> 